taste no difference. I don't want to go to the shop. Pack. Oh god! Oh my god, it's actually rock solid. The chef contaminated things and it ended up with me being in hospital. <laughs> How are you all doing? Welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel. Last week I found out that I had a stomach infection which everything that I ate was wanting to come out that way or that way. Before it was a stomach condition we thought it was a gluten intolerance so i decided to go to the shops and buy tons of free from items turns out that it wasn't gluten and it was a stomach infection i went to buy a lot of free from products for no reason that got me thinking why don't i have a day of just eating free from items which are gluten free, dairy free and nut free i also have a peanut allergy so i have to have nut free stuff obviously all the time <laughs> let me know if you guys like this video give it a thumbs up if you did i would 100 percent do more of these type of videos i love doing food little challenge videos and yeah i'm gonna go get straight into this video and i hope you guys enjoy it and let's just get started hi hello i look awful <laughs> Let's excuse um, all this. I'm just about to go to my makeup pan. I've actually got a array of goodies, but I know exactly which one I want to go on. So, <laughs> for instance, like Alpro vanilla yogurt, which I always have, like every single day, anyways, which is both gluten and dairy free. I have some free from porridge oats, which they taste quite funny. <laughs> Gluten-free Cocoa Pops. I'm so excited to try these out. I'm a trusty, loyal supporter of the actual Cocoa Pops. Who makes them? Nestle? Nestle? Is it? Mm. So when I saw these, I was all excited. However, when I did see them, I didn't realise that it was just gluten-free. It doesn't have the dairy-free bit. However, I read on to find it doesn't actually have any milk in it at all, despite it being chocolate. It just may contain, as a peanut allergen, may contain. If I went off of may contain every single time, I would only be on water. <laughs> so. so we're going to have some gluten-free and milk-free and nut-free Cocoa Pops for our breakfast. Of course, we can't have normal milk. Oh, I can't say it. Why have I always been this? Oh. They were only 85p. Cheaper than the actual real Cocoa Pops. So these are a hit. I'll be taking them. They smell and look the exact same. Can I just have one right now? difference they're like exact the same as cocoa pops i look like a poodle i wouldn't even be able to tell the difference me and my poodle hair are Okay, so I've just finished getting ready. Cereal never really fills me up, like ever. No matter what a cereal it is, it never fills me up. <gasps> Hi, Bobs. Hi, little one. Cereal never really fills me up. And, you know, I've actually not been that hungry. That could just be because my like stomach condition at the moment. However, I'm starting to get a little bit peckish now, just before lunch. So I'm gonna have like a cereal bar breakfast break biscuit thing what is she doing there's not really a lot on the market that is nut free milk free and gluten free however i managed to pick up i can't get comfy honestly 
I managed to pick up these Nairn gluten-free biscuit breaks, chunky. These are oats, dark chocolate and coconut. Of course, dark chocolate doesn't have any milk in it or anything like that. It's on the back that is gluten-free and it's in a factory that is nut-free and milk-free. So perfect. Where the hell is she off to? Okay. So this is what they look like. They come in a pack of three. Mm. Mm. They're really good. Even though they're gluten-free, milk-free and nut-free, you wouldn't have a clue. Mm. But they're like fluffy when you bite into them. I don't know how to explain that. They're fluffy. Uh, here we go, got another dog here. This is my gluten-free jam on toast. I could have went exotic and got some chicken and beans on toast and stuff, but I'm in such a rush at the moment. So yeah. Mm -mm. It's not even like toasted. They're just like cardboard. The jam's nice though. I like the crusts. They're quite nice. <laughs> ASMR. I don't know, I'm just a bit bored. My boyfriend said it's just like a ice cream cone. I'm right enough it is. Gentle. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> Okay, so I'm back from shopping. I had to go to Sainsbury's and Home Bargains and stuff like that with Callum. Callum's away on a road trip tomorrow with his friends. He had to get some stuff. I got a few things as well. Stuff like my favorite crisps and that. I can't have. Also don't have any Snacker Jacks left, which are my favorite. So at the moment, I'm just gonna nibble on some, can I have these? Yeah, ready salted. Uh, golden wonder crisps because all that's in this is salt, sunflower oil and potatoes. <sighs> so, <laughs> I'm in the sink. What's this hair all about? I don't even know. Oh. Mm. <laughs> so it's officially I'm so hungry. I'm so ready. And tonight are you done? Full day of carbs. I've realized on a gluten-free and milk-free and nut-free diet, all you eat is carbs. Back in the same location with the craziest hair in the... Oh no! Oh, I don't have any pasta sauce. What kind of arsehole am I? But what am I gonna do now? Ah, oh, Chloe, you really let yourself down here, then. No! I don't have any pasta sauce. I'm such an arsehole. Oh. So I'll need to go for pasta sauce. But tonight, we having some... Dino pasta. Do we want penny? I couldn't find any penny. Do they have penny gluten-free? I don't know. So I had to get macaroni, so I can't have macaroni and cheese. I mean, I could, but um, vegan cheese. What am I going to use? I don't want to go to the shops. I don't, I don't want to go to the shop. Get that bread, get that head, the meat. Oh god! I can't have that! <laughs> Let's reverse that. 
that never happened, it's only because I was sad because I don't have any pasta sauce. So I thought a little bit of chocolate might help myself out. And I just realized I can't have it. 2,000 years later. Guys, I've been cooking this pasta. Okay, I'm not bald. I've been cooking this pasta for like half an hour and it's still rock hard. And look at it. It's absolutely sizzling away. But what? I'm, I'm actually like burnt the bottom of the pan and everything. I don't know what to do. <laughs> 2,000 years later. Okay, honey buns, there she is. Yum, yum. Look at the pan. Now I told you I burnt it. <laughs> oh my god, oh my god. <sighs> okay. Okay. So it's still like hard, and I'm so confused. Why? Now I owe my mum a 40 pound pan. But. Mm, here we are, folks. This is everything I dreamed of. Absolutely burnt my tongue. <laughs> Dino shapes, they're okay. Um, <laughs> not the same as like actual pasta. This is the thing. Gluten-free pasta is really hard. Okay, here comes a little macaroni shape. They're bland, they're boring, they're hard. I might not have a tooth after this. Okay, hi, hello, it's the next day. Um, shocking fact, I actually was in hospital um, for a few hours because um, of my nut allergy. Went out for something to eat and um, ended up with me being in hospital. <laughs> Good times, good times. I had to come on here really quickly because I am obsessed with these. I have these like at night time with my cup of tea. And of course it goes with the video, this video. They're called No Mo No Missing Out. These are vegan and they're also free from dairy, gluten, eggs and nuts. Um, All suitable for dairy, egg, gluten, peanut and tree nut allergy sufferers. And this is the um caramel flavor and sea salt it honestly tastes like chocolate some chocolate bars that you get that are all them free froms are a bit bland they don't really taste or anything this honestly does taste like chocolate and it also melts in your mouth with the whole caramel and sea salt i really recommend them this is what they look like um amazing caramel and sea salt and of course this is the bet okay so i really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did thumbs up and subscribe down below i found this challenge very interesting um with everything that you had to eat and i was actually in the shops a few days ago and it made me want to look at ingredients more i really hope you guys enjoyed i'd love to do more of these of course let me know by liking this video and i'm gonna go i need to go have a little drive with my mum we're gonna go driving and other than that, I will see you guys in my next video. <laughs> Bye.